Hi, in this Quicksoft tutorial we will cover the basics on how to set up a symmetry plane. When using CAD, symmetry planes can be used in many places, allowing for mirrored modelling and a more simple and streamlined workflow. To begin, we will start by cleaning our mesh out so only the symmetric part is visible. In my case, we have to remove this scan area here. We do this by going to Edit Scan, selecting the Paintbrush tool and dragging over our mesh. We then click this button to hide our selection. Now, we have to roughly align ourselves to the symmetry plane. Then, go to Construct, Symmetry Plane, Define Interactive, and draw a line of symmetry. As you can see, the software will reflect a mesh. We can use the Analysis tool to compare how well it's been reflected. However, it's not very accurate. To increase the accuracy, we need to achieve a more green surface as it will have the least deviation between the two meshes. So, to target this, we will use the Rebuild button, where the software will find the best fit for the both meshes. For more specific data, you may wish to manually adjust your symmetry. You can use the Rotation and the Movement tools, along with the Drag Strength slider, to make a more accurate line of symmetry. If you are done, you can click Create. Another step you may wish to take is to align your mesh to the symmetry plane. First, go to Align by Coordinate System and select your mesh. You can then click Apply and Close. If you check, two of your axes will now be aligned. From here, you can then use the Alt key to adjust your mesh to get your preferred angle for your axis. Then, once you have something preferable, you can go to Align, Align Interactive, and click As Current View. If you check, your mesh should be aligned to your symmetry plane. 